Ba, ba, ba. What's good, YouTube? It's Crispy and T, and I'm back with another Division 2 build vid. Yo, wait, what the fuck am I on, bro? What's good, YouTube? It's Crispy and T, and I'm back with another Suicide Squad Killer Justice League build video for y'all. Today, I got Deadshot's build video. Hey, I got a lot of people who've been asking me for like what I use for Deadshot, and to be honest, I don't use this motherfucker, but hey, I got it for y'all right here today. If you liking the content, man, go ahead, you feel me? Drop me a little like, you know, a little sub, you feel me? Just a little, you know, you ain't gotta, you know, just, just come on, bro, get off that, eh? Now let's get into the video. Here you go, man, this is the Deadshot build. Hey, let's get right into it, I ain't gonna hold y'all up, you feel me? I ain't gonna keep y'all here forever. So check it out, man, y'all know we got the stack deck maxed out, check me out, you know how, and look. And also, we got the stack deck, man. We got 8% crit hit chance for this firearm, 50% shield harvest chance, and 50% damage to create enemies with this firearm. Y'all know what the stack deck do. Get all your stacks up, 750% additional damage, right? Well, moving on to the sniper, we got the master. I'll make it quick. What do you mean by tier three Bane's Fury set sniper? We got critical hit chance with this firearm, sniper rifle damage, and sniper rifle critical hit damage with this firearm, right? Pretty basic, and I am running the tier three. We'll get into that later. Moving on to the melee weapon, we got the master two faces persuader. I'm pretty sure I run this on every motherfucker thing because when you pair that up with Bane, you get the beautiful, the. <laughs> Villain synergy bonus to true face of fury and with this every time you harvest the enemy there will be a grenade drop on the ground with the Bane's fury set being ran we need those nades right it's just hey that's packing a punch with these grenades you feel me i got shield harvest chance suicide strike damage and melee damage to infused enemies also the talent for the two faces persuader every melee hit on a crazed enemy has a 50 percent chance to drop either a live grenade or grenade ammo at the enemy's feet just like just like all these grenade builds man hey the more grenades, the merrier. You feel me? The more grenades, the merrier. Hey, it's simple. And I do have Venom Frenzy Affliction rolled onto this. And we got the tier two grenade for the Bane's Wrath set. I got explosion radius, grenade damage, and grenade damage on crazed enemies with Venom Frenzy Affliction rolled onto these nades. I'm gonna get into why I'm running these certain tiers later. So moving on to the shield mode, we got the Master Unbreakable, right? While there are four or more crazed enemies within 20 meters of you, you deal 100% more damage and take 50% less damage. Sounds good. Hey, I got critical edge chance shield harvest chance and sniper rifle damage rolled on here of course moving on to the traverse mod can we get a round of applause man? hey let's just clap it up for this motherfucker right here because this motherfucker i ain't gonna lie this thing right here has put us on its back you hear me this if this ain't on your build you're doing something wrong right this is another 750 percent damage when you're always moving and when you run in these incursions you gotta always be moving you out of your fucking mind if you think you're finna stand still complete this shit let me see it <laughs> let me see it for my neck bomb mod this is the last of the tier two set that i will be running i got grenade damage to ground enemies shield harvest chance and damage to crazed enemies now let me tell you why i'm running this tier two so when you get the fully maxed out tier two bane set right you get this talent when you kill a crazed enemy or an enemy you craze kills another enemy you trigger a stack of bane's wrath this lasts for 60 seconds and increases the damage you do by 50 percent up to a maximum of 750 there's a 50% chance to trigger Bane's Wrath when you craze an enemy that's below 100% health. So you gotta think, we got the stack deck, that's 750% damage, right? We got the Steel Force Conduit, that's 750% additional damage. We have the two-piece Bane set that's now giving us another 750% damage. And I'm telling you right now, it doesn't stop there, bro. We got another 750 to get with our last piece. We got the tier three Little Acito Bane's Fury Lucky Charm, man. Let me tell you, the two-piece tier three, look at this shit. Critical hits on enemies below. 50% health trigger Bane's Fury. This increases damage by 50% and damage to crazed enemies by 50% for 60 seconds. Each stack of Bane's Fury also adds a 5% chance to cause enemies to explode on death and crazed enemies within 10 meters. That's cool and all, but pay attention to this last line. Bane's Fury can stack up to 15 times. 50 times 15 is 750% additional fucking damage. This is 3,000% additional damage on this Deadshot build. Are you fucking kidding me? This is the stats. This is how you run it. Copy and paste. Now let's get into the talents. Let's get into the squad skills. And let me get y'all ass on y'all way so y'all can go these incursion missions out baby let's go as always i'm gonna go ahead and pop the camera off y'all go ahead and get your screenshots in take your time be articulate with it here are the squad skills that i'm running for death shot go ahead and get your screenshots in
and that's the build man let me know what you guys think down in the comments also let me know how are you running your dead shot builds do you guys think there's a different way to match this up and and put out the same amount of damage get through these incursion missions let me know down in the comments make sure to drop a like on the video share it to your friends share it to your mom or else i'm gonna call her and get on your ass i appreciate all the support man let's keep going up let's keep rising hey i got y'all as long as y'all got me you hear me it's chris and t man and i'm up out of here What's next? 